We wanted something that was different. We wanted a little bit of the wow factor, but we also wanted it to be very user friendly. What we tried to do was come up with a concept of how we would want to teach and then we decided what kind of technology would be required to make that possible. We were working on a research project and we had a, um, a remote lecture from one of the scientists at the Smithsonian that directly related to what we were doing. We sat right here and watched this gentleman and we could talk, you know, questions and answers. It was amazing. I taught a class from my daughter's uh, living room in Richmond last semester because you can link into the Polycom system and see the whole class. If I want to call on you and ask you a question, if Eagle Eye is engaged, rather than just giving me a pan of the room, it will, the minute you start talking, find your voice and zoom in on you. We can see you, we can see your expression, we can see your body language, we can see all those things that make good teaching happen, that pedagogy of connecting with the student. Uh, it's just, just amazing. As you walk through the facility, you'll notice technology is incorporated into every nook and cranny. We broadcast our programs that are taught live here to a variety of other places. We also receive uh, educational content from a lot of our um, university's home campuses. We also deliver what's done here, what happens inside the building, to a lot of different places throughout the Commonwealth and really throughout the world. It has changed what we do here because now there's an expectation that NCI and our programs here will be cutting edge, not only in terms of the technology we are able to provide, but also in terms of the way we design what we do here. That's getting attention at the state level and we hope to take that beyond to the national level.